Hi everyone, Bob is in the house and today we are reacting to Haim's new album. Uh, hopefully I'm saying the name right, Haim or Haim, I will just say Haim. Uh, but uh, yeah, I have never heard of uh, Haim's music before and actually I would not react to this album uh, if there wasn't this comment on my channel. Um, Shout out to Brian Riccardi, hopefully I'm saying your name right. Um, yeah, basically the dude suggested me to uh, listen to their new album and uh, he said that it's gonna be a good album so let's just see uh, by ourselves now how it sounds like. And uh, personally, as I told you, I've never heard of Haim's music. Only, I know only like one track by them, by that band is uh, their collab with Kevin Harris, Pray to God, in the uh, Motion album, and so, yeah, that's the only song I have listened to, so I don't have an idea uh, what the genre is going to be like, uh, probably pop or alternative, but we're going to check it out right now, so let's dig it. Hey, something to tell you, first reaction, let's go. Track one, Want You Back. Some things were never said. Okay. Nice start. We were like us. You kept trying to prove me wrong. I think I have heard this before, actually. Yeah, this was a single, right? I think I have heard it. So you ran away. Just know that I want you back. Just know. Just know that I want you back. And it may never be enough, but don't take it out on me now. Cause I'll blame it all on my say I was wrong. But all the tear in control, I'm ready for the move. I want you back. Hey. Okay, okay, okay. Not bad. Good, pretty good. Uh, I actually want to say that. I actually want to say that um, I I'm wearing this outfit because like I want to kind of conform the feel of the album. Uh, like, as I understood, like from the album cover, you know, like it's gonna be very like a summer album, something like that. Well, at least what I got it from there, you know, like the, the glasses and stuff like that. Uh, I wanted to like make it like a beach feel, you know, like. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> uh, that's what I want to mention. Track two, nothing's wrong. With nothing to say Gone through the mind away How could you tell me nothing's wrong? Tell me, tell me, tell me nothing's wrong Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me nothing's wrong Tell me, how could you tell me nothing's wrong? Tell me, go and tell me what you want What? What's happening? <laughs> Dang. Okay. That's nice. That's awesome. It makes me still moving. <laughs> oh, good track. Yeah, that one. That one was good. Really good. Um, it reminded me of um, GTA. Why city wife? <laughs> you know, <laughs> like when you uh, are playing with Tommy Versetti, you know, with the with that like a uh, beach T-shirt, you know, like when there's like palms, like the gray, uh, the green T-shirt, if you remember, guys, like uh, when you were like driving 
on the radio there was like sounds um, music uh, was like that that kind of um, feel that kind of genre you know and uh, it's pretty cool I like what I'm hearing right now track three little of your love you're just another cover and hide I wasn't even on the track You wouldn't even give a touch My love was gonna be good enough You're so close now You gotta keep swimming and get up for you And not try You can't keep your swimming and get up for you, baby You gotta keep your swimming and get up Keep your swimming and get up Don't wanna feel like that next Yeah, the production is beautiful. <laughs> that reminded me of like, um, um, I would say country, right? Like country uh, genre of music, but this is not country. I mean, I actually don't like country, really. Like, I don't like country, but this is not country, <laughs> you know? This is like alternative slash reminder of a country <laughs> at least that track was like that so uh i, I i'm digging it so far really yeah, enjoying uh very chill very like uh co relaxing um kind of like just giving you like good vibes and you know uh don't like stress you with something like or depress you just uh just calm songs uh not not even calm but like relaxing fun songs yeah but yeah that was a good way to put it i guess <laughs> track four ready for you All my crazy regions, all my ears, maybe okay x talks <laughs> track for I was uh, paying attention this time for the lyrics uh, because like the ex talks you know like uh, when it's uh, about the uh, ex-boyfriend and his girlfriend so you know I'm this is an interesting topic to me because yeah I have an ex about who I still care about anyway um and it's just like she was uh, kind of saying that I wasn't ready for you in the, in the song but then like it was she was like kind of referencing like before I wasn't ready for you and like I still didn't get the, is she ready now for him or no <laughs> like and the song style is ready for you so I kind of got confused like I didn't like con I couldn't connect the dots you know like uh, let me know in the comments below what happened there <laughs> but uh, as far as like if you wanna know my like personal story or something like that I'm not gonna talk about it right now uh, but uh, you can go ahead and uh, check uh, Halsey's album after this if you want to. In that uh, album reaction, I kind of talk about it a little bit uh, with a sad tone, and I don't want to be sad right now. Uh, let's just move on. Track five. Something to tell you. It was too much to take, even though I tried. It was never enough. Put my name in the same damn thing. Tell me how you feel. Tell me how you feel. Cause I got something to tell you. <laughs> Sometimes just catch you off guard. Like they sing and then like. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Tell me how you feel. Yeah, I enjoy this track, especially the production on point. Nothing else to add. Track 6. Never knew. This is 
instrumentals. Yeah, on this track, like, it surprised me a little bit. Um, track six. I think that's the first track where I kind of was. Uh, I mean, the production was so good, the lyrics were good. It's just like I felt like it could have been shorter. Like the song could have been like easily only three minutes, you know, rather than like four uh, minutes thirty seconds. Yeah, four twenty nine. Uh, I feel like really like the, she was repeating like uh, you still didn't know. I, I guess you didn't know what you like. What do you need? Like the line was re repeating over and over again. Let me check what was the exact line. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, I, never, I guess you never knew what was good for you. Yeah, it was just like over and over. Um, but um, yeah, the the production is good and like it's very consistent. At least so far, it's still very consistent. And uh, hopefully and probably uh, like. It's gonna go on like this till the end of the album. So, track seven, kept me crying. I like, I like this, uh, like what's happening right now. Also, like, okay, fuck it. Also, now, so basically, like, I like the way uh, the heartbeat was kind of presented, like the, with the beat, like, do, 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 like, it's like she was stressed, you know, like she was worried, and like the song was like showing that, you know, like with the beat. Track nine. Walking away. That's very sexy and sweet delivery over here. because uh, Walking Away was a very smooth track and very sexy in a way the delivery, I liked it a lot and the uh, instrumentals were like very really cool, great throughout the track, you know, like the instrumentals were placed really perfectly like and it uh, added to the tone sort of did like made that delivery uh, perfect, you know, like, uh, and we received the complete product of it, like, you know, turned out to be like this, you know, it was great. Like, the vocals and the, the instrumentals were very well thought out, you know. Uh, track 10, right now. And I also like the fact that it's minimal, you know, like throughout the record, the instrumentals are there's not much going on, but it's simple, and by that, by the simplicity, it's good. You had me hanging on a dream you never believed. You gave me a word. Yeah, you see with the instrumentals again, like the dramatic presence they are adding. We have come to the last track. Uh, 
night so long, track 11. I say goodbye to love again. Oh. Sweet. Okay, final thoughts on this album. Well, it was a good project, it was a very good project. I really liked it, um, the way Haim was able to stay consistent throughout the record was uh, incredible. I love that fact, and also I love the fact that the instrumentals uh, were a key point uh, on the delivery, um, you know, like uh, to make the uh, music sound good, and uh, by the fact that like it was very simplistic, uh, it actually turned out very well. Uh, rather than uh, make everything complicated, Haim was able to just uh, sing what they want to sing about, and you know, like uh, add on uh, a very good feel instrumentals uh, together, and uh, they pulled it off really well. And uh, when I was uh, listening to like the first tracks, I was feeling, oh, this is gonna be like a really good feel album, uh, because like the the atmosphere, like the vibe, was very positive on this on that on those records. I wasn't really paying uh, attention for the lyrics, so that's why I didn't know. Um, you know, like I don't remember what they were singing about on the first two tracks, but. Um, then when I like from track four, you know, when I started actually like to listen what they were singing about, um, I understood that hey, actually like they're uh, singing, like spitting their souls, you know, giving you actually uh, stuff to think about, and also uh, even though like it still happens with the uh, positive attitude rather than like a neg negativity. Right or like sadness, uh, it still uh, makes you think about certain stuff, uh, and just like uh, wonder what they're saying, uh, listen to the lyrics. The message is there. Uh, it's not like a great summer album to like uh, dance without like having a conscious mind, but this is like the album actually where you like just sit down and listen to it. But still, for sure, some of the tracks are still. Uh, good actually to just put it in the background and like uh, do your stuff um, with a, a kind of positive, positive mood. Yeah, I guess uh, other things I wanted to mention, I think I already mentioned in the uh, tracks, like uh, uh, <laughs> the tracks, like uh, when like the tracks were going on, you know, like I wanted, I mentioned what I wanted to mention, you know, and the that's my conclusion basically. Time album is good. Check it out. That was my reaction and review of this album. Hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to this channel. Help me to reach thousand subscribers as soon as possible. And uh, I love you guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Пока. Hi. Auf Wiedersehen. Arrivederci. Adios. Ciao. Ciao. Uh, I'm in what? For the office? Yeah. Goodbye. We kissed in a tunnel.